Updating Apps Store Connect or Google Play Store takes a lot of your time. You have manually copy and paste all app information such as titles, keywords, app descriptions and so on. Especially if you have everything already ready in a place, maybe in a Google Sheet file like I have here, for example, it's, yeah, you have to select all lines, all cells one by one and copy everything to the stores. Isn't there an option how this could be done better, quicker, in a more efficient way? Yes, there is. With the App Store Manager, you can easily import your already ready-made translations and text with a bulk mechanism or with a bulk upload to the stores. To do so, I have to log into the App Store Manager to import things with JSON file import. The free subscription is sufficient. To prepare this file import, you can find a template within the App Store Manager itself. And you can, of course, prefer this template. Of course, I don't want to copy things from my sheet to the template because then I haven't saved that much time. So I have created a script with Google Apps Scripts, which takes those values here on a click and creates this file for me. So basically, this is the structure. I take this information and add it to a text file, and now I'm able to import it to the App Store Manager. Basically, the App Store Manager allows you to configure multiple apps. It, this is related to the subscription you are using. For the free subscription, you are allowed to create two apps in total, and you are able to create your app descriptions within the App Store Manager itself. So you can directly type in here and copy, of course, here as well. Or as in my case, I can initially import my information now from Sheets uh, to this JSON key file within my App Store Manager. I have prepared my template already. I press import and now I have all values in here. You can see I changed the title of my app to my awesome car app. It was my nice car driving app um, in the store. And now I can select my imports, uh, all of them or just a couple, whatever I require, and add them to my app descriptions. So I haven't done anything in the App Store yet. All is within App Store Manager. I see now the list with all languages which I have imported. I can filter for languages where there are some errors. If I click on them, I can see the title length exceeds the maximum allowed length of 30 characters. So I can change things in here, adjust things if I like, press on save, and so work through these errors. Of course, it should be best if I already have checked my links and other things within my source sheet, but I haven't. So basically I verify everything in here and validate things in here and translate and adjust and so on. Once am I ready and I'm already ready with 24 of my 39 languages, I can upload everything quickly. I navigate to upload to App Store and upload metadata. Here I can have an overview of all languages which are ready to transfer and I click on upload. When I upload things to the stores, of course, uh, information in there is overwritten. So for me, that's fine. I click on OK. Now my upload is been started and my metadata is copied to the App Store Connect. Take a while, maybe one or two minutes, and then everything should be in App Store Connect. Of course, to access the store, I have to provide some credentials for accessing it. And basically the mechanism which is used here is the API access key mechanism. So you create access keys within App Store Connect or Google Play Console and provide those keys to the App Store Manager. The credentials are stored securely for the purpose of this transaction only. But of course you can, if you like, also store the credentials for later usage. So it looks like we are good here. I click on logs and we see our metadata was successful uh, transferred to the store. 
I navigate to App Store Connect, I click on Refresh, and you can see for our example, the title has changed here to my awesome car app. To sum up, of course, I could have copied everything from my source file, which was prepared by someone else, by professional translators or whoever. I could have copied everything cell by cell to App Store Connect, or as seen, I use the App Store Manager to copy everything just with a few clicks um, to App Store Connect. This, of course, works as well for Google Play Console. And once things are set up, which may take maybe one to five minutes, you're good to go and could reuse this mechanism again and again. And it saved me a lot of my valuable time, of course, and can save yours as well. So give it a try on appstoremanager.net or read more on iwantanelephant.com.